turned himself into the Bexar County Magistrate's office Friday night just before 9 o'clock, but he didn't spend one night in jail. I thought I was doing everything as a mom to protect my children. <laughs> this mom is in agony after learning the man charged with sexually assaulting one of her daughters isn't in jail. It hurts. You can... Nobody knows what my kids are going through. She didn't want to show her face on camera. She says her family's nightmare began four years ago when 39-year-old Roger Juarez allegedly walked into the bedroom where her nine-year-old daughter and her siblings were sleeping. When he walked her out, he walked her into his bedroom, um, proceeded to undress himself and told her that she needed to take her underclothes off and she refused to do so. Juarez allegedly took them off for her and proceeded to have sexual intercourse with this nine-year-old child. The girl's mother says her daughter didn't come forward until last September. Not only that, but she says two of her other daughters also made similar accusations against Juarez. And I asked them why didn't they tell me and they broke my heart because he threatened them not to tell me. Juanes was already in prison when the outcry was made. He was paroled in April on a narcotics charge and indicted on May 23rd for aggravated sexual assault of a child. He turned himself in on Friday and within an hour had already posted his $75,000 bond. I'm thinking it's not right that my kids have to live with this and He's free to do whatever he wants. This mom says her children are now in fear of seeing Juanes, but she promises she will protect them. What he did was wrong, and I hope he knows that my children have to live with this for the rest of their life, and I hope he does pay for what he did. Police say more allegations against Juarez by other children are pending. He has a lengthy criminal record, including narcotics, evading arrest, and assault charges. We're live downtown, Aaron Nichols, Fox News at 9.